Hey guys, okay, um, this is my first time vlogging or showing my face on this channel right here, but it's at the studio, um, people mainly know me as Ayumi, so whatever, but my real name is, you can call me Sammy, everybody here calls me Ozzy, call me whatever you want, you can call me Bag, if you, if that was what you're into. Anyway, um, so, yeah. My friend, Faith, who I call Koda, uh, a very good friend of mine, she moved me in her Seven Flaws video, which made me cry, by the way. And I thought, okay, if she can do it, I can do it, and, um, you know, maybe it'll help support or whatever, so I thought, okay, I'll do it. And I'm camera shy, so I might be stuttering and stuff while I do all this. But, just bear with me, okay? So, it's really hard posting yourself on the internet because you never know what people are going to do. I guess I'll start this. I have recorded this vlog thing three times and it keeps on Xing out or, or messing up because I'm using Windows. Anyway, okay, so, I'm going to do this quick, okay. Flaw number one, I have insomnia. I don't know why, I can't sleep. You see these darkness under these eyes? I haven't slept in days. Not because I'm staying up late doing stuff, I'm just, I can't sleep. It's really hard. And I go to therapy and the therapist is like, oh, it's probably because your past because all the stuff that was bad to you that ever happened was at night and you were afraid to sleep. Flaw number two, uh, well, I have, I change my mood very easily, like, really quickly, like, I see a picture, and all of a sudden my mind's done a 180 and I'm upset or angry or something, I mean, there's a lot of things that make me upset, like, yeah, like, dude, yeah, and whenever I see people who, like, ooh, like, okay, how do I decide this, I'm doing this quick because I don't want to mess up again, um, whenever I see people with their family and they're all like being all brats and stuff like that or like being rude to their parents, I want to punch them in the face because it really, really makes me angry because like in my family, they're all I've got like a handful of friends here and I don't, if I can like deal with my family and we have domestic violence in my family, we beat each other up and stuff and there's alcohol and drug addicts and stuff going on, then you can. Now, for some things, like, you know, if your parents are abusive or something like that, then, of course, you have every right to, you know, be, you know, different. But what I'm talking about is, like, to a kid with their dad, and they're, you know, like, like, I don't have a dad. My dad killed himself when I was a baby. So I never really had a dad. And like that annoying car ride to the grocery store with your dad that you don't want to go on, I want that. I really do. But I know that I will never get to have it. So I just, I'm angry all the time because when I'm in public, I just get so annoyed with people. And sometimes it gets out and they find out about it. Flaw number three. Number three, um, I take things like to heart, like, like, whenever I see a toy that nobody plays with, I want to play with the toy and give it love, if that's weird enough for you, or, uh, you know, like I, I want to support everybody, and I, even though I'm not into it, stuff like that, like, uh, this ribbon right here, okay, it's, uh, you know, a homestuck thing, and I'm not a homestuck really, all. A friend of mine is, well, a lot of them are, but this in particular, my friend's like, it's homestuck day, everybody has to wear orange to school and stuff, so I did it, even though I'm not into it, and I kept it, just because it's a memory, you know, and I want to keep it for the rest of my life, and, you know, you know, those sort of things are attaching, or, like, this teddy bear, I found it at a thrift store, this is the cutest bear in the world, I don't care what you say, but I'm really sad that somebody would give this bear away. So, I 
I see something or someone and I just want to cherish them. Ooh. Four! Okay. I'm not perfect. Nobody is. We are all perfectly flawed, and that's what makes this unique. But for me, myself, I'm not... I'm not skinny. I have scars all over my body, that's why I always cover my arms. My hair is thinning, I have a crooked nose. Um... I have a thick accent that I hide, and hiding it makes my voice very raspy, if you can tell. Like, I don't know, it might sound clear for you, but it sounds like a train wreck over here, and I'm not even sick. Ugh! Okay, um, so yeah, nobody's perfect, and uh, if you think you are, UTFO. Like, okay, how do I explain this? Like, I can see in color, but it's not exactly what I believe. It's like, I thought in my mind that my eyes were blue, and they're not. They're green. I thought this hair dye was blue, but it's not. It's green. These walls are supposed to be blue, but they're not. They're green. I don't exactly see everything in the of the show. Okay, yeah, just because I see him, Professor Stein, I thought his hair was purple whenever I watched the later. If that says anything. Uh, which is really hard because I'm trying to get better at coloring, but I don't, I can't even tell my colors apart, you know? So, I cherish everything. Like, sentimental items and stuff like that. Like, like, when I see a toy given away to, like, the thrift store, I cry. Don't laugh, but, like, this this teddy bear right here, okay? I found this in a big box of other teddy bears. This is the cutest bear in the world. Uh, I, I get really upset because, like, I believe everything should get, you know, some type of love and affection. And I want to be that person to do it, you know, like, in a weird way. So I got like a lot of stuffed animals and pets and stuff like that. Or like this ribbon over here, okay? I don't know if you know what Homestuck is, but it's like one of my friend's like favorite things in the entire world and I've only read a little bit of it. She's like, it's Homestuck Day, everybody has to have some orange on. So I wasn't into Homestuck, but I did it anyway. And I kept the ribbon because it was a memory and I cherished it. And, you know, like, years down the line, I'm gonna be like, where did I get this ribbon, you know? But, I don't really care. And, like, everything, every time somebody makes me something, I put it on my wall, or I put it up on display. Because I'm just that type of person. And sometimes it's bad, because I have all this clutter in my room over there. And I can't get rid of it, because it brings back memories. Lights on! Anyway, sorry, um, half the video cut out, and so I had to redo this part. Um, yeah, sorry. Six, uh, a flaw is I'm hard of hearing. I can't hear well. When I was born, my ears were damaged, and... Yeah, um, I listen to my music very loudly. All the way up. And sometimes it really bugs my family. Um, okay. And my last one, number seven, is I'm very clingy and I attach easily. Like, I can go and, like, one time I went to this Linkin Park concert and I met, like, the coolest chick there. And I changed numbers and stuff, and then all of a sudden one day she just stopped talking to me and I was just like, creepy stalker, like, why aren't you talking to me? But, yeah. A part of me knew it wouldn't work out anyway. Anyway, I had to rush that part. I, mean, okay. yeah. uh, I will probably be doing more vlogs, vlogs or something. Because uh, they're a lot more easier than editing. Uh, I don't know how you guys do it. So don't ever stop. Um, bye.